Hello, I'm Dibuo, and this is the Mudao's channel. Welcome to the Mudao's channel, and today we're gonna be cooking mashonja. In Chivenda, we call it mashonja, but it's actually mopane worms. So I'm gonna show you how to cook mopane worms, but in a vendor way, in a Chivenda way, or is it in a vendor way? <laughs> okay so yeah it, no i think it's no it's oh my god i don't know <laughs> it's it, in a vendor way so i'm gonna show you how to cook in a vendor way i've seen a couple of people try to cook it but they mix a lot of things of which i don't understand why and they're not necessary but hey i mean you can create your receipt it's a free world so yeah I'm gonna do it in a vendor way, tradition way, traditional way, and you'll see how it's done. And I hope you like it. So let's do this. Okay, here we go. So now, what you're gonna need is your onion, tomatoes, and chilies. But chilies, is, it's your choice. And you're gonna need obviously this. <laughs> Uh, mopane worms which is mashonja and now we're getting ready to cook okay so next step is the cooking of this mashonja what you do is you put them in a pot pour a little bit of water let it boil and add your mashonja mopane worms in the pot and then let it boil for like 10 minutes uh, after 10 minutes we're gonna do we're gonna be adding the onions and tomatoes and and and, and chilies okay so after waiting for 10 minutes for the water to uh what is it drain or simmer to simmer away <laughs> yo english Okay, so now it has boiled and I poured in a little bit of oil. So let me just add a little bit more. Okay, that's good. And then now, okay, now you add your onion. So what you do is you fry the onion with the my funny ones, I'm just gonna go ahead and reduce the toast um, before this thing pan. So now is I'm just frying the onions and mopani ones, mashonja. I'm just gonna call it mashonja now because I'm sure now you know what mashonja means. I mean, I don't know what they call it in Situana, Sizuli, mashonja. Okay, my wife just confirmed they are called masonja. In Chivenda, it's mashonja. So what I did, I waited for the water to boil until it's, you know, boiled, and until there's nothing, there's no water in the pot, and then I added a cooking oil. And then now I just added onion and I'm busy frying. Um, it's not gonna take long before it turns brown because the stove is... Okay, so now I'm adding my tomato. Tomato. I just, it's just one tomato. Uh, and let it, let it cook a little bit it's doing just fine so far um let me just go ahead and add my chilies remember it's your choice i mean if you don't eat this some people don't like hot stuff like chilies so if you don't like it don't add it you know The wifey is very hungry, so I need to hurry up. 
but i don't think it's gonna take long because it boiled enough you know so all i need to do is fry this let it fry you know with a medium amount of heat or low so that it doesn't burn you know remember when you boil it you need to add a little bit of cooking oil in the water so that i don't know how i'm going to explain that but it it, it it cooks fast faster when you add a little bit of water um and mashonja it cooks fast it boils fast so it will be nice and soft so now it's cooking with the um tomatoes and onion and what you can do you can just add a little bit a pinch of salt you know if you want because some people don't like salt too much and too much of salt is bad i shouldn't even be been adding this yeah, that's enough too much salt is bad it's bad for you okay so many people are adding things these days that i don't even know why because i mean this has to be cooked traditionally you know uh so i i i do it traditionally i'm not gonna add some weird spices or weird things but hey it's your choice i mean it's not a bad thing it's not a problem if you like it with the soap or with some spicy thing or whatever but i do know uh one of my aunt she add a little bit of raja should i add raja okay my wife just said no so <laughs> it's a no <laughs> it is a no they say if you if you if you um if you like making choices every time do not get married <laughs> because once you get married uh, they're gonna make choices i'm telling you i'm telling you i'm telling you they will ask you how many slices of bread do you want and then you say four and then she said oh you mean so don't you want three or two <laughs> i don't know if i'm the only one who who faces that who faces that but yeah it's happening i'm not lying she, she say i'm lying she's saying i'm lying i'm not lying that's how women are. i'm not saying i mind it's not a problem okay i'm not let me stop talking too much. Let me just mix this a little, a little bit. Okay, it's almost done. So now, what I'm gonna do is add a little bit of water and let it cook. Look, this is very, yeah, this is very traditional way traditional way traditional way of cooking it um this is how we cook masonja and i mean if you're gonna add other things i'm not saying it's a problem but i think this with the way i'm cooking it it's like cooking a, a, a goat meat you know you can't be adding some things stuff in a goat meat all it needs is it's oil uh, no, not even oil all it needs is salt onion salt and water some people add um uh, what is the uh, uh, stock yes it's fine but i mean even if you don't add stock a brick of uh, a, a piece of stock it will still taste nice you know so yeah here we go just let it cook for like um 10 minutes um and then it will be done that's it 
now is busy cooking it is almost done it's not gonna take long and i'm gonna be serving this with pap and spinach yes it's the man in the kitchen today it's the man in the kitchen boss <laughs> I do cook for my wife sometimes when I like. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I actually cook every now and then because I mean, it's a good thing to do, you know? It's a good thing to do. So as you can see, it's busy cooking and it's almost done, like almost. And I'm about to cook my spinach over there and I'm cooking pap right here, it's, it's too much, yo. Um, yeah, let's finish this up and let me show you the final, final result, man. Let me show you the final result. So these are the results. I think I did well. It's pap, spinach, and mashonja, the mopani worms. I think I did well. Comment and tell me how I did. This is nice. And my wife is already eating. Goodbye guys. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and please like and share. Thank you. Bye-bye.